Hey, are you a struggling young chef? Do you wake up every day and you tell yourself that you are one flavor away from becoming the next Gordon Ramsay? Well, fuck that. Every day you wake up, you think you are one flavor away from becoming better than Gordon Ramsay. But every time anyone tries your food, they go, brother, ooh. What's that, brother? Your girlfriend tried the food. Your boyfriend tried the food. One bite and they left you. They said they never loved you. You go over to your parents' house. You make food for them. And after the first bite, they all tell you that you are adopted. Do you go to sleep every night thinking, damn, why, why does my food taste this much like shit? Well, it is not you. It is not your fault. You just have been doing this Oh, this whole thing you've been doing it wrong because the correct way to do it is for from barfly 7777 barfly take it away My friend here, Barfly7777, teaches us all the secret flavor that has been missing in your food. Because after cooking for your girlfriend inside the airplane's sink bathroom, and after cooking in a hotel sink, or even your own sink in your own bathroom, doesn't matter, each place has its own flavor. After that, your girlfriend will never leave you and she will love you forever. And she would say that you are the best chef in the world. Now, I came across this video on Twitter some time ago. I just didn't make a video about it because a lot of dramas were coming up. Basically, this guy who I think started a normal cooking channel, but it wasn't clicking off. So he just decided to think outside the box. And we all know how that goes for most creators. Hello, this is Kush, your documentary man. Today's air special airplane meal is going to be made, airplane made. First thing we need to do is we need to make sure the battery is working. So we click off with a iPhone charger. And obviously we have our kitchen counter special made. We make sure the water is boiling and it is ready with salt. And we put some butter with our bare fingers because why not? We're already cooking in a sink. Then we add some flour inside. We mix it up with the shrimp and mashed potatoes inside the sink because bowls are overrated and voila, it is done. We put it in a throw up bag because why not? We clean up after ourselves, I think. So if you're tired of the shitty food poisoning meals they give you on airplanes, definitely try my methods because not only you will get food poisoned, but you will also die. Now, bro looks like he's very depressed with his life and is trying to do content creation to be out there to get some compliments on the internet. To, you know, feel happy, a little bit happy with, with himself and put on a wholesome personality on and he looks like his his body is immune to all the germs merms herms everything that's out there because the amount of shit you you find if you put a uiv i don't know what, what they call it, uv i think uv light there you're gonna see a lot of shit little did he know 30 minutes before he shot the video there was a guy who could not hold himself till he gets home and beat his own dragon so he decided to go to the bathroom and kill some children. I don't know if I'm allowed to say that, but you know, like shoot some babies in, in the sink. And bro just made mashed potatoes, some shrimp and some baby flavor and ate it like a champ. Hello, we are back at it with another video. This time we are going to make disgusting bathroom nachos. First thing we do, we get our water vibrator. So we make it nice and juicy. We cut up all the fruits. We mix it up with tap water and we let them enjoy themselves inside the water tap jacuzzi. We cut up the fruits nice and gently. Make sure we use a dirty towel under it for extra ingredient. Same towel, we wiped our ass like 30 minutes ago with yet again extra ingredient. Don't worry if you think the water is too dirty that's how it's supposed to be extra ingredient flavor extra flavor ish we spice it up with our own hands add the fruit and potatoes this is good this is the spicy sauce 
to it. We make sure everything is nice and disgusting. And when the meat is nice and juicy, we empty the water. We make sure we wash the sink with the meat, make sure everything is clean, and nice and juicy. We mix up the fruit, add the nachos, and that is when you add the meat to it with the sauces next to it. And since you came all this way, no need to use a plate anymore. You just eat it straight from the sink and voila best shittiest nachos you'll ever try fastest way to die from food poisoning honestly it just makes things easier in many many situations you want to take a shit but you're on a timeline to cook don't worry you can shit and cook all at the same time you want to shower but you also have to cook don't worry shower while you're cooking you can wash your food inside you can wash your chicken breast inside the shower as well and to give it a little bit an extra flavor fart inside the shower give it a little bit of flavor to your food and everything will be voila honestly whatever we watch over here is still better than the indian food street food makers the, the things i have found there we made a couple of videos about it as well i think i removed them from the channel but if you watch those videos we have autumn pit flavor we have td flavor where they rub it while they're sweaty and they just you know put everything <laughs> inside the food and rub it there's mouses going around there's cockroaches pretty nasty stuff and i won't be surprised if 50 percent of their customers died from food poisoning from the places <laughs> from indian street food places now i won't torture you with more videos like this i'm not even sure if this guy actually eats the whole thing or maybe he just takes one bite from this food and he's like oh mm -hmm. like and subscribe thank you very much and then just spits it out the next thing we know he's gonna be boiling eggs inside a toilet water or making noodles inside the toilet water but yeah i just watched this video and i felt really disgusted and i wanted to share that feeling with you so you'll feel the same as well also it's 11.11111k so make a wish you know those 11 11 anyway you know what i'm talking about so close your eyes and let's make a wish together did you make a wish for a big booty Latina girlfriend too? If you're still eating that delicious food of yours and your hands are too dirty to change the video, bring your tongue click on one of these videos. You're welcome. Take care of yourself. Thank you for watching. I'll see you at the next one.